we're going to explain how to make a Christmas tree that looks like this using the proggy method. You'll need fleece and hessian and either a proper proggy tool like that or you can do it with a pencil. Okay. The basic technique is you're going to make a hole in your hessian material with your pencil and put one end of a piece of fleece through. You're then going to count two strands on your hessian and make another hole and put the other end of your fleece through like that and then pull the two ends on the other side so they're the same length. When you've cut, you need to decide what shape you're going to cut your hessian into and you'll need to cut your fleece into strips about a centimetre wide and then cut them into lengths of about four to five centimetres long to put on your tree. Okay. You need to fold your hessian back about two centimetres along the edge and fix it in place at regular intervals with your fleece progged through so that it keeps its shape. You'll need to do that all the way round until it looks like that or on the back it'll look like this. Then you need to fill in all the places each time you put one in, you need to count two or three strands of hessian away before you put your next one until you've finished. And on the back, your finished product will look like that. Particularly because it's curved at the bottom, it's not vital that you keep the line straight as long as you fill. So if you look at it and you see a gap, you can just put some more fleece in to fill a bold patch. Okay, and on the back, you should see it's looking like this. You can put extra colours in if you want to put other colours in, you don't have to just do it. This was a patterned piece of fleece. When you've got to that stage, you're then going to join your two straight edges together and sew them. You don't need to worry about your stitching particularly because it's going to be hidden under your fleece. And then you've got a fleece like that. If you wanted to, you could then prod chocolates through, the twisty end of a chocolate through to have chocolates on it as an extra treat 